Kenya's opposition leaders are right in the middle of this crowd, talking to the people, uh, strategizing how they can uh, get the commissioners of the Electoral Commission out of office. They say they will hold protests like this one every Monday until those commissioners leave office. There has been tight security here ever since the protests began. And across the road, that is the University of Nairobi, learning has clearly been disrupted. University students coming uh, to watch what is going on here, people leaving their places of work in town. The opposition says that they will not go into the next election, which is due next year, with the current commissioners in place. But they have been challenged by the ruling party as well as the electoral commission itself because there is a constitutional process that can be followed to remove the commissioners. But then the opposition says that they will use people power to get those commissioners out of office. Furthermore, the current electoral commission has conducted numerous small by-elections in constituencies and counties since the last general election. The opposition has participated in all these elections and has not raised any contentions. They have been asked why bring these demonstrations now, several years after the election uh, they are talking about uh, that they say was not credible.